But good morning. It's that time of year again. We're going to change the uh, the oil and the lawnmower blades here on this bad boy lawnmower. So come along with us, and I'm going to show you how we change it around here with a trot to change the blades to jack it up. Got a hole spout over here. Up under here, we got to take loose. Now, I think the oil field is over here on this side. Black hole. Come on, let's go get the tractor while that's uh, draining the oil. We we'll use the bucket here on the tractor to pick up the lawnmower, change the blades on it. So let me get on the, the tractor here and pull it around here by the uh, garage door. But the oil's still draining. We'll give it about 10 minutes, let it drain pretty good. Then we'll take the oil filter out of it and replace it. Okay, we're gonna put the plug back in here. I think it's about through draining. Let's see, what did I do with it? Let's go over here and let's get this on. Oh, filter. Y'all ever put any oil around the, uh, the little gasket here? I always been told to put a little oil around this gasket. Make sure the seal's pretty good. It's about hand tight. Y'all ever made a, a funnel out of a little plastic bottle? Seems like they were never a funnel laying around. There's always a plastic bottle somewhere. Let's see here. Thing the book says it holds two quarts of oil. Let's talk about one and a half here. That's one quart. Put about half of this here in here and get it warm and I'll check it over there when we uh back over there by the blades. You'll see we need to add some more to it. Who in the blaze has applied that emergency brake?
Don't lose that washer. Get in the way. Them little fins go up. Yeah. Don't be getting all up under there, huh? Let's see back out from under this tractor. Then don't be out. At least put some air in the tire over here too, I right get it. Well, what did I do with my funnel, with my funnel? Let me go get my funnel so I can finish putting these little bit of oil in it. I think the other side's gonna need some air in. Looks a little down to me. But that's good on the oil. Blades have changed. And it's got to put everything up. They ain't no air going in that front one either. Okay. That looks like it's 
No, that one looks all right. Well, that's what she loves to do. Cut the grass. See if she's going to try it out, but I think she'll. She just threw it in the yard, she has tried it out. I want to show you these street blades here. Uh, we go through about four or five sets of these a year. And we cut about two, two and a half acres here. But I tell you, I just don't want the blades. I guess there ain't much metal in them, I guess. I remember when people used to sharpen these blades. But you look at the end of that one there. Nothing. There's nothing to it. I just wanted you to see them. They're trying to make some nice change of blades. Thank you for stopping in today.